Hi, this is TK Viper and today I'm going to show you the inside of Lawson's, a convenience store here in Japan. One of my subscribers told me that the US on the East Coast used to have these about 10 or 20 years ago and he really wanted to see one because he hadn't seen one for decades. So here we are, this is the one in town. They're usually 10 minutes apart so it's not rare to have two or three convenience stores around your house. They're open 24 hours, seven days a week, so you can get almost anything you need, anytime, anywhere. Most of them have parking spaces, but this one's on the main road, so only parking for bicycles. You can see the color theme there is blue. The logo, I think, is a milk bottle, and if they sell alcohol or tobacco, usually the sign will be up there as well. It's 1 a.m. right now, you can see some of the stocking uh, shelves and carts out there. I chose this time because I didn't want to record when there are a lot of people inside. The clerk might ask you to leave or stop recording. But on this night, everybody was home, no one was here. The clerk was mostly in the back room stocking stuff, so no one bothered me. As you can see, there are three trash cans out there by the entrance. Yeah. So in Japan, uh, convenience stores are one of the few places you'll find trash cans in the public. So let's check it out. So right away you can see the sign pointing to the ATM on the right. We'll turn left to check out the counter where they hand you your lattes and drinks you've ordered and your hot food. You can see the microwave latte machine there. Also newspaper being sold right there. On the left we have a machine to pay for stuff electronically like uh, tickets for Disneyland or other attractions, uh, other uh, events. We have two boilers for uh, instant ramen, umbrellas, raincoats, magazines for job hunting. On the right we have an ATM that's connected to most banks but there is a service charge. This is a multitasking or multi-purpose copier printer. You can send your photos and documents over there to print. You don't need to buy a printer in Japan. So here we have all the energy drinks. You can see Red Bull right there. There are many other kinds of Japanese brand energy drinks. Next we have medicated uh, stuff and also uh, masks for people with allergies and then we have toiletry section and a section for the women makeup so last minute makeup there you go just visit a convenience store if you've forgotten to put on the makeup and then this section is for your hair products wet wipes for your body if you didn't have time to take a shower there we have all the prepaid cards Apple Store Google Play and then we have a freezer for cheaper ice cream this is a section you know for magazines you can see some naughty magazines behind the hidden uh, hidden behind those little shelves it's a small section usually they're bigger there's the bathroom or the toilet and then the freezer has you know block ice and also crushed ice and more expensive ice cream like stuff from Ben and Jerry Hagen dazs and sometimes Baskin Robbins we have frozen foods here like TV dinners then we have soda tea and uh, iced coffee right there and then we have beer and uh, uh, chew highs or uh, wine coolers next we have a beer snack section with all the dried meats and nuts peanuts and cashew we have a nice selection of wine here usually very cheap wine and then going back to the second aisle we'll see where they have all the confectionery goods like uh, chocolate cover, donuts, stuff like that, or bamguhen, a popular German cake. So basically this is a section for all your unnecessary carbs and sugar. Alright, going back to the second aisle, we can see all the cleaning products there, Windex, uh, clothing detergent, dish detergent. On the right we have all your regular snacks, chips, potato chips, Pringles from the US, and a bunch of Japanese flavors They usually change depending on the season. And then we have your instant cup noodles or instant noodles. This side we have pet foods for dogs and cats and sometimes hamsters. Down there we have paper, plates, utensils, and then toilet paper and tissue right there. And then a section for leggings and underwear and socks. Here are the two sections for stationary and electronics goods like uh, chargers, USB memory drive. And down there we have gloves for manual labor. Okay, now let's head to the front, check out their uh, deep-fried section there. It's empty right now because it's 1 a.m. 
usually it's full of uh, fried chicken, chicken nuggets, french fries. And then here we have oden, a Japanese uh, kind of fast food. It's uh, a bunch of fish cakes and eggs boiled in a special soup. They're 70 yen each. Here we have yogurt and cakes. And then on the right we have all your candy, gummy bears, gum, all there. On the right we have a large selection of chocolate. Dark chocolate is a, is a favorite in Japan. They don't like sugar so much. Then we have hard liquor here. You can see whiskey, vodka, Japanese sake. And then we have your energy bars and also a caffeinated uh, drinks like coffee, drip coffee. All right, then uh, let's go back to the beer snack section. I'm gonna choose uh, something to eat. These are thick cut beef jerky, but I'm just gonna get the regular beef jerky. They're cheaper, 50 grams for about like $4, so quite expensive in Japan. All right, heading to the last aisle, we have on this side, uh, kind of pre-made food in a bag. You boil the bag and you eat the content. Also canned foods and instant rice on the top. And then here is a section for people who like to cook. We have pre-made sauces and uh, broth for hot pots. And then we have all your sauces here. Ketchup, sugar, everything that you need for cooking. And then a large section for bread, bakery. All right. On this side we have juices and uh, drinkable yogurt and milk. Next we have a little deli with pre-cut vegetables, lots of ham, cheese, uh, turkey. Then we have some eggs and bananas, pre-made salads and uh, salad meats. And then we have all your bentos or lunch boxes, various kinds of be uh, bentos. And then we have burritos and some sandwiches on the top. And then moving on to the left, we have a cabinet with full of onigiris or rice balls with different flavors and different fillings. And then a cabinet with heated drinks, so great for the winter. We have cigarettes to the left of that. And that's it guys. Thanks for watching. Please like and share. I'll see you guys next time.